Hey, Wink, it's uh, David Buprecht. Uh, happy to be on your website. Uh, in just a minute, you're going to be seeing the pilot episode from Supermarket Sweep, which we did back in 1990, and then went on to do uh, 14 seasons. Uh, the pilot, though, we actually shot in a regular supermarket out here in the valley, and uh, so when the people were adding up all their goodies that they'd gotten in their shopping cart, there were uh, condoms and uh, vodka and uh, a lot of feminine hygiene products. Uh, but in the studio, when we actually got the pickup and we went into the studio, they didn't have those things. So just hams, turkeys, diapers, and all the other good stuff we launched for 14 years. Enjoy. <laughs> Remember this television show? People were running wild through the aisles of the supermarket, grabbing everything they could get their hands on. And what's more, everything they could carry out was theirs to keep. Well, it's that. The television show that says, go ahead, do what you've always wanted to do. Get it all. Everything in this supermarket is yours, and it's all free. So, let's give a big welcome to the return of the all-new... Supermarket Week. And now, let's meet the host of our show, David Rupert. Is there anyone in our studio audience who would like to win $5,000? Okay, let's find out who's going to get that chance. Some of you are holding some of these well-known products. Cheerio, Taster's Choice, Soap, Pepsi, Soft Scrub, Gippy Peanut Butter, Oreo Cookies, and Bounty. Now, we're looking for three teams of shoppers. Okay? Who's got the Oreo Cookies? Come on! You're on! All right. Who's got the Scope? Come on! You're on! The taste is short. Come on, you Okay. We've got our players, and now we're going to find out just how smart these shoppers are. But first, let's meet them. Jim and Lisa. Jim and Lisa, why don't you tell us a little bit about yourselves? Well, we're neighbors, we're best friends, and we both have two kids. Oh, that's great. And and did you uh, coordinate your outfits before you got here? Yeah, we, we planned it this way. We're a team. We're a team. This is great. And who does the shopping? Most of the shopping. I do the shopping in our family. I definitely you do. You do the shopping? You do the shopping together? Yeah, I do. Yeah, yeah. Uh-oh. Uh-oh. Oh, there's quite a team going there. Okay, Lori, why don't you tell us about you and Bill? Well, we've been married for 10 years. Great. <laughs> and um, I do most of the shopping, but... Bill does some, probably he doesn't like to. Julie, tell us about you and Kevin. Well, Kevin is my boyfriend, ah. and uh, we're both students at USC. I'm a psych major, and he's been studying law. And uh, I hesitate to ask, but who does the shopping? He does! All right. <laughs> That's great. Now, players, you are going to need all of your shopping skills today, because later on, each team will be taking a mad dash through the supermarket for the chance to win $5,000 in cash. <laughs> Because every second counts, we're going to give you a chance right now to earn extra time. And the more seconds you can win, obviously, the more merchandise you can grab. Now, we need the first shopper from each team. Who's it going to be? Uh, it's going to be Bill, Tim, and Julie. All right, partners, we'll see you just a little bit. Each team starts with a free one minute and 30 seconds for the big sweep. And here's your chance to earn more time. Now, these products are all under $3. Take a look at this. Here is a nine and a half ounce package of Lean Cuisine cheese cannelloni with tomato sauce. This frozen dinner is from Stoker. Players lock in the price that you think it sells for in this market, and the player who comes closest to the price without going over will add 10 seconds to their free time. And if you hit the price exactly, you will win 20 seconds. Okay, you've got your prices locked in. Tim, what did you come up with? $1.49. $1.49. Bill, how about you? Two twenty-five. Two dollars and twenty-five cents. Julie, how about you? Two sixty-nine. Two dollars and sixty-nine cents. Well, the exact retail price of that item was two dollars and fifteen cents. Kim, you did not go over, so you win the ten seconds. That's great. All right. 
Now this, this is a 28 ounce size of Heinz ketchup in its new reusable container. Please punch in the exact retail price of this. Remember, if you hit the exact price, you'll win 20 seconds. Prices are punched in. Bill, what did you have? One ninety-eight. One dollar ninety-eight. How about you, Bill? One forty-nine. One forty-nine. Of course you did. Are you asking me? You put it there. <laughs> How about you, Bill? I said a dollar ninety-nine. A dollar ninety-nine. Ooh, only a penny separating the two of you. The exact retail price of that item was one dollar sixty-nine cents. Julie wins the ten seconds. <laughs> We have a very close game going here. Get ready, because here's the music. You're going to hear one clue which directly refers to a brand name product. The first player to buzz in with the correct product will add 10 seconds to their sweet time. But watch out, because if you're wrong, you will lose 10 seconds, okay? You ready? Here is your first clue. This drink mix sounds like Dynasty Mrs. Carrington on a diet. Oh, Jim. Crystal light. That's exactly correct. We had another 10 seconds. How did you get that so fast? I drink it all the time. You do. <laughs> this is your second product, one clue. It's a sad story, but this guy had to divorce his first wife, Mrs. Met. Bill. Mr. Clean. Absolutely correct. We had 10 seconds to go. <laughs> All right, and here's your final final product. After the Thanksgiving turkey, the kids may fight over who gets this brand of salad dressing. Tim, wishbone. Absolutely correct. Another ten seconds. <laughs> All right. <laughs> Joe. After those first two games, Tim has two minutes. Bill has one minute and forty seconds. He's tied with Julie with one minute and forty seconds. And we will be right back to see how well their partners do with shopping right after this. <laughs> Let's say hello again to Lisa, Lori, and Kevin. You guys ready to play? Yeah. Okay. Now, your partners have started on your way, but now it's time for you to go shopping. These next items will all be over $3. Over $3. Remember, the shopper who comes closest to the exact price without going over wins 10 seconds. Hit the exact price, and you win 20 seconds. Okay. Tell me the price of this. This is an extra-large carton of Minute Maid. It contains 96 ounces of orange juice. Now, please punch in the exact retail price. Lisa, what price did you come up with? I said $3.98. $3.98. Okay. Lori? $3.99. $3.99. Oh, you guys shop at the same store, I'll bet. Yeah. <laughs> Kevin, how about you? I shop with them. I said $3.98. $3.98. Look at that. Only one penny separating all of you. The actual retail price on this was $4.19. Lori, you got it. Take a look at this. This is Sara Lee Frozen Chocolate Mousse Dessert. Mmm, yeah, it weighs 21 and a half ounces, and it's large enough to cut into 10 slices. What is the exact retail price? The person who gets closest to the retail price without going over gets 10 seconds. All right, Lori, this time you're first. What Three price? $3.29. $3.29. You seem a little shaky about that. Who knows? <laughs> Kevin, how about you? Uh, $4. $4 even. Okay. And Lisa? Well, I think I know my dessert. Uh -oh. $3.59. $3.59. <laughs> the exact retail price is $3.79. You do indeed know your dessert. That's great, Lisa. Terrific. Okay. We have Lisa out in the front with two minutes and ten seconds, but Lori nipping at her heels with one minute and fifty seconds, and Kevin right behind with one minute and forty seconds. But we've got a lot more games to play. Now, here's a game called the Mystery Product. We've locked out the names of some famous products, but we know that a lot of shoppers have such a keen eye, they'll recognize them anyway. Now, the first person to buzz in and correctly identify this product gets ten seconds added to your sweet time. But be very careful, because if you buzz in with the wrong answer, we're going to have to take away ten seconds. Are you ready? Okay. Here's your first mystery product. This product says, good morning. Lisa. Total. 
Absolutely correct. <laughs> How did you get that so fast? It's something I have in my cupboard at home. Oh, well, that explains it. Yeah. Yes, that's great. The next mystery product. It pals around with milk. Lori. With milk. No, no. no Lori. I'm sorry. We're going to have to subtract 10 seconds from your time. <laughs> we have some more clues. Some like it hot. It goes stir crazy. Use their name in a crunch. Ah, here we go, Kevin. Nestle? Nestle's hot chocolate? I, oh, no, not quite good enough. And <laughs> one more clue. You make this, then you must have hot cocoa fat. Absolutely. Absolutely. Yeah. <laughs> oh, oh. Kevin, you were close on that one. And this is your last mystery product. Think of beautiful hair. Kevin. Silken? No. Sorry, you lose 10 seconds. This shampoo sounds like it cleans your hair subtly and delicately. Glory. Finesse. Finesse. Absolutely <laughs> correct. You go 10 seconds. Add extra 10 seconds on you. We have Kevin with a minute and 20 seconds, Lori with a minute and 50 seconds, and Lisa with two minutes and 30 seconds. We have more games. We're about to show you a special gourmet food and give you one last chance to win more time. But first, let's bring back your teammates to help, because in this game, one correct answer could be worth 30 seconds. All right, are you ready? Now, because this is a gourmet food, and it's such a unique item, the team that comes closest to the correct price, either under or over, will win 15 seconds. And if you come within 10 cents of the price, you'll win 30 seconds. All right. Now, this small basket contains gourmet California stem berries. They're long stem, extra large strawberries, which are picked later to taste sweeter. Okay, partners, you must agree between the two of you on the exact retail price for one small basket. You have 15 seconds. Start talking. <laughs> All your prices locked in. Okay. Tim and Lisa, mm -hmm. what price did you say that small basket was? We said three ninety-eight. dollars and ninety-eight yeah. cents. Yeah. There seemed to be a little dissension among the red ranks over there. Uh, uh, who no, won out? Is what I want to know. Well, we know they're expensive. Yes. You know, there's a kind of dip in chocolate. Mm. Mm. So that's what we came up with. Between the two of you. Actually, yeah, you, we you agreed on it. On yeah. Good yeah. for you. Good for you. So. Bill and Lloyd, what did you come up with? Three ninety-nine. Three ninety-nine again, only a penny a part. Oh, no. And Julie and Kevin. <laughs> Three ninety nine. Are you sure? Three dollars and ninety nine cents. The actual retail price is four dollars and fifty nine cents. We have a tie for those fifteen seconds. Oh. Julie and Kevin, Bill and Lori, all about the extra fifteen. There you go. That's what you did. With those extra fifteen seconds, you got much closer to Kim and Lisa. These are the final scores going into the big sweep. Right. Kim and Lisa have two minutes and 30 seconds. Lori and Bill have two minutes and five seconds. Julie and Kevin, one minute and 35. All right. Which okay. member of your team is going to run the big sweep? Oh, I am. We got Bill, we got Kim, we have Kevin. All right. Don't you go away because when we come back, you're going to see our three players running wild through the aisles for a chance to win $5,000 here on Supermarket Sweep. <laughs> Welcome back. It is now time for our big sweep. Uh, Kim and Lisa, you have two minutes and 30 seconds. So your team won. You'll start first. Okay. Bill and Lori, you're team number two, and you'll take off when the clock hits two minutes and five seconds. Right, let's go, Bill. And Kevin and Julie, your team number three, you will go at one minute and 35 seconds. All right. Listen. No matter how much time you have, smart shopping can make all the difference in the world. Just look around. The entire supermarket is all yours. Just grab anything your heart desires and throw it in your cart. When your cart fills up, no problem. Rush back and get another one. And while you're racing through the aisles grabbing merchandise, be on the lookout for these cash pennants that are tied to lots of products throughout the market. We have $50 pennants, 
$100 pennant and $200 pennant. Now, this one's attached to the French bread. But if you want the $200, not only do you have to bring back the French bread, you have to bring back the baker who baked it. <laughs> now, everybody remember, at the end of the big sweep, our bell will ring and you must stop shopping and come on back. The team whose runner sweeps up the most money in merchandise and bonus prizes wins the game and the right to go for $5,000 in cash. Okay. Runners, are you warmed up? Are you stretched out? Okay, get ready. The clock is set at 2 minutes and 30 seconds. That's when Tim will take off. On your mark, get set, go! There goes Kim of team number one starting her big sweep. Now let's see where she's hitting first. It's the boxes Atlantic Thomas. Now our rule is no more than five of any one item. Okay, she's got her five. That's about $75 right there. Hey, where's she going without her shopping cart? She spotted the baker with $200. Look out, Kim. Don't drop him. It's a long way back to the checkout counter and the clock is still running. Uh-oh, there goes Bill, and here comes Tim. And here's Bill racing down the aisle. Where's he heading? He's found Senior Pico, who's holding a bag of Doritos. Bill's pushing Senior Pico back to the checkout counter because he's worth $200. Now we're back to Kim. What's she grabbing for now? Oh, she missed it. Well, our rule says you have to pick it up, and she did. Well, now she's going for the frozen turkeys. Two, three, four, five. Well, that's her limit. And here's Kevin and Julie, team number three. Now, Kevin's starting his big sweep. Meanwhile, Bill is loading up on steak, roast beef, and lamb. Now he's going for the boxes of smoked salmon. That's two, three. Does he want more? Yes, five. That's his limit. Now, here's Kevin loading up for the first time. What's he going for? Looks like he's picking up big, expensive legs of lamb. He seems to be taking his time. What's he doing? Harrison's just being a cup for He wants them both. Back to Kim, who's stocking up on whisk detergent. And there's her teammate, Lisa, cheering her on. Uh-oh, Tim just dropped something, but she's putting it back. And here's Kevin again. He's carefully piling chickens into his pug. What? He's actually putting them back. And his partner, Julie, can't believe it. He wants expensive crabs instead. No, he doesn't. Teams one and two are getting ready with empty carts for their partners. Here's Lisa of team one giving a fresh cart to Tim. And she's on her way. And here's Lori of Team 2 giving a cart to her husband, Bill. Look at Kevin racing with a bonus box of Eva towels worth over $200. What's Bill going for? Let's check it out. He's reaching for cans of baby formula. And he's going after bottles of rubbing alcohol. Yes, he and Julie must need them. And look at Kim. She's in the health and beauty age section grabbing everything in sight. Look at that. Five boxes of anisette. While Kevin's piling up the turkeys. But time is running out for everyone. Five, four, three, two, one. Don't go away. We'll be right back to find out which team has the highest total in cash and merchandise. That's the team that will go on for $5,000 in cash. Supermarket sweep, and this is the moment of truth. Our checkers are standing by, and we are about to find out who won the big sweep. Okay, Kevin and Julie, you have all of this merchandise plus two hundred and fifty dollars in pennants. Your checker is Mark. Mark, show us Tim and Lisa's total, and your grand total in cash and merchandise is four hundred and ninety dollars and thirty-eight cents. <laughs> Look at all that merchandise. Plus, you've got $250 in pennants. Gloria is your checker. Let's see their total, Gloria. And your grand total in cash and merchandise is $683.89. Okay. Okay, now, Tim and Lisa, you grab lots of merchandise plus $200 in pennants. If your total is higher than $683.89, you will be today's winner. If not, Bill and Lori win the game. Your grand total in cash and merchandise is $597.17. Wow. But Bill and Lori, you have won this week. It's all yours to keep. Congratulations. And to our other team, thank you very much for playing this game. Bill and Lori, you are going for the $5,000. Get over here. That's 
great. Congratulations, Lori. That was great. Congratulations. You got just the right products and all the products and all those tenants. That was great. Okay. Now, right now, there is $5,000 in cash hidden behind a product somewhere in this month. You have one minute to find it and three clues to help you. Clue number one will take you to the first product where you'll find the next clue. And as soon as I give you the first clue, the one minute countdown will start. Are you ready? Oh, yeah. Keep breathing. <laughs> Good luck. Here's the first clue. This year's Emmy went to the gang at the Boston bar called Cheers. Yeah. Right. Yeah. Here. 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 Where look? Here. Where's the cheer? $683.89. Congratulations. That's great. This is David Ruprecht saying goodbye for Supermarket Sweep. Remember, when you're at a checkout counter and you hear that beep, think of the fun you would have on Supermarket Sweep. Congratulations. <laughs> fun wink so uh thank you for including me and we'll see you next time if you like this make sure to subscribe to my channel for more and check out my facebook page for other exciting content you can play free games and win real prizes